I kind of like that. Uh, excuse me. Hello, everyone. Vase of here, and welcome to a Monday stream. Uh, I apologize ahead of time. I'm probably a little bit groggy because I literally woke up from a nap because uh, I didn't sleep for, I think it was 27 hours or something. And then I, I was trying to stay up uh, to reset my schedule because stupid stinking daylight savings time. I don't know anyone that likes daylight savings time. And um, thank goodness I had my alarm because, <gasps> excuse me, um, that went off. And uh, have you ever been so tired where an alarm goes off? You're just like, ah, oh, damn. And you think it's something else? Yeah. So I know I'm not looking at the camera now. I... I've been trying to start up Life is Strange 2 this whole time, and uh, it's acting very strange. Anyway, um, what I was saying is my alarm went off, and I thought it was to wake up for work <laughs> in the morning. And I was very confused. It's so stinking dark outside. Um, are you serious? I don't feel tired at all. Crap, I missed the stream last night. Oh, no, this is not good. And then uh, after my brain started waking up and started coming to... It was just like, uh, no, dude, this is, uh, this, this is your alarm to go do stream. You should probably, you know, you should probably get, get up and go do that. So, yeah, why, why don't you get on that? Anyways, we're going to be playing some Life is Strange 2 today. Uh, we may finish it. I'm kind of, I think maybe episode 4 was just fast, or maybe I got through it really quickly or something, but, uh, it was, it was finished in one stream, so, uh, maybe... Uh, fifth episode will be similar. Um, why? There it is. Jeez. What was I saying? Oh, dude, I'm so, I'm still tired. Can you tell? <laughs> um, there we go. I see. Excuse me. I don't know if it was short, but the idea is, at the very least, we're going to be playing some Life is Strange 2 today, possibly finishing it. Um, if we do, whether we do or don't, it'll be finished tomorrow. Um, and then Ori and the Will of the Wisps gets released on Wednesday, and I'm really excited. I didn't realize it was releasing so soon. For I knew it was releasing in March, but my brain just didn't click that it's March now. So I was like, oh, crap, we need to play that. So I picked it up. Uh, we will be starting that. The Discord vote is still up for the other game to play. So, yeah, be sure to go add your votes to the Discord and uh, determine what we're going to play next. Hi, Dougie. I love you. And Ori should probably last, mm, probably last over a week. The original one was pretty long, but when I played it on stream last time, I kind of knew what I was doing. And I also kind of burned through it. I didn't really get crazy exploring because I have the definitive edition and I didn't um, explore much of the definitive edition stuff. I guess that's what you can say. <clears throat> oh, hold up. Don't do anything weird, game. I needed it. Oh crap, no wild. Ooh, just wild died. world. There were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They lived in peace until hunters took their dad away. No, not the wolf doggies. The wolf brothers wandered for days and nights, learning how to live on their own for the first time. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. They decided to head south to the distant land of their ancestors. But the journey was long and dangerous. Still, the wolf brothers made new friends on the way. They learned more about the world, but danger seemed to always follow them after a bad accident. They were separated. The big brother had been hurt, and the hunters finally captured him. They put him in a cave. Look at him. But when he finally escaped, he went to search for his little brother. He soon found out that the little wolf had joined a coyote cult, and he would not leave them. Suddenly, their mother showed up. After all that time, Mother wolf. She said, she came to help rescue him. They begged the coyote leader, but she would not release the little wolf. He was their idol. So they had to knock her out. 
to escape. Oh, the sad wolf wolves. Brothers, now reunited, followed their rogue mother far into the desert to her hideaway. Wolf with eye patch. That's cool. Coyote cult, huh? Oh, ow. That one was popped weird. Okay, hopefully we have some b better outcomes than the last couple ones. Well, I guess last one we had a good outcome. Nobody really died. Oh, yawning. Sorry, guys. There's probably going to be lots of yawning tonight. <laughs> Seven weeks later, huh? <clears throat> Yeesh. Why did that give me the willies? I'm not even that scared of scorpions. I'm not I don't even think I'm really scared of them. Just cautious, like nope, don't want to fuck with those. Um, little pinchers. His butt spike. Ugh, would not want to sleep outside in the desert. Not just because scorpions, because apparently they get. To wherever they can get they go into your boots because it's warm because in the desert it gets cold at night hey what's up wake up sean mm. dude come on what what time is it get up it's so beautiful check it out grand canyon grand canyon's in arizona right Sounds right. Also, I forgot to check my computer. I restarted it today because it had been running for like a week solid. And the freaking fans finally started working. <laughs> like being so, quiet. Yeah. It's very upsetting. Okay. Good call. Now they're loud again. Wow. That's amazing. I know. Is your eye okay? It's just... Yeah. It just itches. It's okay, Nana. I... Promise. Yeah. Uh, okay. I love you. No matter what happens. You hear me? Yeah. I love you too. Brothers, always. Wait, so mom gone now? Or we're just like cool, peace, thanks, bye. So, although she could have been like that. Are you still having those bad dreams? You know, about Lisbeth. Yeah. Sometimes I feel like she's around, coming after me. It's scary. She's scared she's lucky. No shit. Oh. She's lucky you didn't go after her. I still thought I was a keyboard and mouse, apparently. Yeah, but she's still out there. Somewhere. Creeps me out. Yeah, she's kind of creepy. We're together. Listen. We're far away from her, okay? We're together again. Safe. <laughs> Hope so. Sean, are we criminals now? Mm, not really. Well, sort of. Sort of. We did a lot of illegal shit. If the cops catch us, 
we'll be judged for what we did. That's for sure. Yeah. I know. Oh, shoot. I forgot to well, release YouTube videos today. Dang it. We're almost at the border. Finally. I like it here, but we'll have to leave soon. I know. I'm sorry, Anna. Sean, I know it's been a long time. Can you tell me the rest of the wolf story? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I can tell you. <sighs> been forever since we left off. Way too long. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, thanks to their mama wolf, the wolf brothers barely escaped from the coyote cult. She led them to her secret lair deep in the red desert. The wolf brothers rested for a while, but at some point, they'd have to continue their journey south. They were closer than ever to their father's land, but between them and their destination lied a mighty fire unicorn. <laughs> <laughs> but she's nice, so they become friends. <laughs> uh, um, excuse me, who's telling the story? You are. But oh, look, they have it's my story too, right? Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Okay. A then. mighty fire, you. So what happens next? Uh, I hate him. They they arrive in Mexico, but the country is rampaged by gobbles. Gobbies. Together, the wolves and the unicorn manage to slay them and become heroes. She needs a bath. She's got. The police forgives them. Some skin thing going on. All friends Mexico to celebrate. <laughs> Watch out. Yeah. Move your butt. Sounds pretty good, and I know. Let's back this shit up and head back to town. Gotta clean up our stuff before we leave. This okay. place is too pretty. So incredible we get that? to see all those stars and planets up close. <laughs> it's like we're right there. I hope we can go watch the stars again. Mom said there's a moon eclipse coming up soon. <laughs> I'm in. This place is cool. I could just move here. Hey, I can help. Just tell me what you want to put in there. You are the man. Food container. Soda. Sleeping bags. I'm glad we had these. Not a fan of desert critters. Yep. Every star looked the same until we used Karen's old guidebook. Oh, we're gonna have to draw. Oh, we gonna have to draw. Ooh, sketching time. Good idea. It's awful loud. I'm glad you can still draw after. Mm -hmm. You know. <laughs> no shit. <sighs> I went in and just fuck it up. I don't think I did. I think I did that at the very beginning once. My back hurts a little. Thank God. I'm glad we're sleeping in our bed tonight. Are we? What bed? Laser eye zoomy powers. Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. Gotta we do want. I'm ready to draw now. Hey, can you draw me as a superhero? Like, Heck yeah. striking a pose over the canyon. Heck yeah. Mm. We'll draw him badass. Try. It's 
Sweet. Okay. Is that a Hydra? Or a dragon? Anything else. Oh. It's so nice and cool in the morning here. Then it just... Tada. No, I was listening to him. Let me check it out. Jeez. Do I really look that evil? He looks more like a super villain. Aw, oh, man. It's even unlocked. Out of ink. All right, buddy. You activate flashlight. On the way. I know I told him that we shouldn't be using his powers anymore, but we're gonna Let's do clean this. up this mess. Not if it cleans up by itself. Stop. Mm. Daniel can't catch it, huh? No shit. <laughs> now cut it out. Jeez, you're no fun. Hopefully, no one walks up behind us. Kind of guessing we're in the middle of nowhere, though. All right, we should be okay. Eat Yo, the soda. Captain can can you take these away? Sure. And no funny business. <clears throat> of course not. Perfect formation. Are we good? I like how he, he's got to reset his pose every time. I swear dad had that same book in the garage. Yeah, it's probably for mom. I think he did. Why did he never show it to us? Maybe it reminded him of mom too much. Oh. Yeah, right. I want to know where we got the telescope. Karen let, about, let us borrow it, probably. Well, let's hit the trail, cowboy. Yeehaw. Dude, nobody can put a sleeping bag in one of those bags that fast. They're like stuffed by machines. That's why I always get rid of the, ugh, the normal bag. Doing? Get one of them stuffed bags. No time to play. Don't do that. What the fuck, dude? Don't do that. What's wrong? Stop messing with it, man. Yeah, you're right. Sorry, little guy. Don't get eaten by eagles. Do eagles eat scorpions? No idea. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Let's go. Hey, potato. Nope. Man, this. Look at this backpack. It's all jacked. Falling stars, or any. <laughs> Don't piss when they fall. We saw the Milky Way. Hey, we saw the Milky Way, dude. How cool is that? Yeah, that's true. And Mars. That was so cool. Arthur and Stanley let us use the telescope. Who's Arthur and yeah. Stanley? These guys are real cool. These are the. Hey, stone stacking people things. See this? Looks like the ones you get back in that <laughs> comes in, pushes me over. When you got sick. Oh, totally. Wait, does that mean other people were here? Of course. Maybe someone from away did it. Look at this. This is awesome. I bet it was Joanne. This is creepy. Feels really close. Like the edge feels way closer than it probably is. Didn't Joanne will let me help her with her sculpture when we get back? We need <laughs> help, bro. You're like the magic assistant. Amazing that anything can grow out here. Does it ever rain in the desert? Well, oh. Of course. Uh, good question. 